Hello guys, this is a 1960-ish, late 60s, early 70s, uh, Gilson Snowblower, branded Montgomery Wards. Now this snowblower hasn't ran in a few years, but when it was running, it's a beast. But this engine is a fire hazard. And it's been sitting outside, and I have not gotten to it. So I'm like, you know what? It needs to come off. So, in its place, I know I'm going to get a lot of hate. Predator. Nice, easy to start. Uh, that Predator is the one that was on the tiller. Which, now i got an 8-horse Briggs on that tiller. So, that's good. So, we have an engine for this. Now, everything should bolt right up. Uh, should. So, I'll have to figure that out as we go. Uh, I don't know if it needs new belts been a long time since I put this engine on I'm saying 2013 and this son of a gun is a powerhouse so I'm gonna have to if I have to I'll have to source some new belts so I'll uh, cross that once we get into it so this thing is not safe I've been uh, debating on selling it, but around here it doesn't sell. But this thing here will go through some good snow. But, you know, the thing here is when you're selling something this old, if something breaks, you're screwed. So, alright guys, let's dig in. Okay, the belts look alright. Stuff looks like it's going to line up. So... This shouldn't be too hard to uh, swap over because everything's self-contained. So, we'll find out. Okay, guys, it was pretty much straightforward. I had to tweak the belt guard a little bit. But, uh, it was nice and easy. So... It was pretty much a straightforward, no mods other than the tweaking of the belt guard. So let's see. Choke. And it still has a little bit of a drag to it, but it'll be all right. So. I'm not sure exactly what's dragging. I'll look into it a little bit more. It's probably just the uh, belts rubbing on the pulley when it, as it's slowing down when it's not engaged. Which isn't a problem. So. That's it. That snowblower is done, pretty much. There's the model tag. So, I mean, I will pop that guard off and look at it a little bit more before uh, it comes out. But that's all for this video. It's just nice and short. I mean, I didn't have to turn on the camera to show you what I did because there was nothing to it. Okay, well, I will technically show you. Okay. 
so I had to tweak this guard right in here add this other bend to get it better I still can tweak it right here and bring it in a little bit more which I might do and it might make that squeaking go away because that's what I'm pretty sure what's going on so I just added this bend here So, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. I'm going to tweak a little bit around on it a little bit more and then uh, call it good. So, really quickly, I got it to quit uh, grabbing because the engine a little bit is a little bit different in the belt guard sense. I had to cut out part of that cover so it's not pushing against that belt guard on this side. And it seems to be a lot better. Okay, it's on. No dragging noise. Alright guys, thanks for watching.